Holy smokes, happy people. Today is a day I've been waiting for my entire life. Yes, you put it on safety? This will be her first time ever shooting the crossbow and I wanna get it on video. Okay, this is the Bear X Constrictor Pro. Right in the center of that red. I see. Oh my gosh, how awesome was that? I hit it too high. Let's see where you hit. I hit it too high. Okay. Hey, that's why we're here. Come here, Aria. Come here. You hit it right in the red. I know, but it wasn't the circle. This is where I wanted it. Wait, I was aiming right here. Okay, so you missed by like an inch. This child has very high expectations for herself. What do you want to shoot today? What do you want to hunt for? Deer. What about a hog? I don't really care because I don't want to really. I want to shoot with that because that's more comfortable. You want to shoot with that? Yeah, I want, if there's a hog, I want to shoot with that. So Okay, so you just want to shoot with a crossbow? Yeah, that way I would. Yeah? Yeah. Knox. This child is the delight of my life. I, see that little white circle right there? That's what I want you to shoot. I that circle now. I've been working with her mentally for years now about paying attention and understanding what hunting is. Hunting isn't just shooting something. Hunting is the pursuit. It's a lifestyle. It's understanding that life, death, food, it's all interconnected. It. Spread your feet a little bit. Spread this one. There you go. So. I feel. Where'd you hit? I was so, literally just so close. Let's go look. I'm a proud daddy. You hit right there. You hit the circle. Aria, you are awesome. Look, look, we're gonna try to pull it out. Um, um, what did you hit? The white. Is that what you were aiming for? I was aiming right here. <laughs> Where were you aiming? Right there. <laughs> the 20 yards, I think we're okay. You ready to go hunt? No, yeah? No, I'm gonna shoot with that. I know, we're going to take that and go, but we're running out of daylight. Yeah, I want to shoot. Do you see a little orange dot in there? Uh-huh. See the little dot? Is the little dot a little lower than the crosshair? Yeah. Put that little orange dot exactly where you want it. Oh, but what is the I'm... What does the number say in top of here? Uh, before it said 29. It said 29? Okay, that was, that's how many yards it is. It's 29 yards. Put your crosshairs back on it. 29. 29, 28. see the little orange dot? That says 28. 28, okay. That means it's right on the edge of 29 and 28. Uh -huh. Put the little orange dot right where you want to hit. Where am I, where am I? I want you to hit right in the middle of the, of the orange. See the big orange? Mm -hmm. Shoot the lungs. Hold this hand down here. Oh. Just like that. I, I, this thing keeps shaking on me. Keeps shaking on you? It keeps shaking. Let's see where she hit. Right. She has oh. an extremely high level of expectation. She's a perfectionist. You just saw, those are the th first three shots she's ever taken with a crossbow in her life, ever. Did you see that? That's perfect. I've been aiming for the middle. <laughs> How do you deal with this? All right, y'all, we are gonna get ready and we're gonna head to our stand. 
It's beautiful, nice, probably about 72, 73 degrees right now. Tomorrow morning, it's gonna be super cold. And here in Florida, deer don't like it super cold, so. To put this in. Hopefully. We never forget this. You excited, baby? Yeah. Look, there's the deer right there. See the deer going? Oh my gosh, yeah. See the deer? Hi, this is Jimmy for dinner. And hi, my name is Arya. I am in the deer meat fam family, and I am about to shoot a big deer. See ya, but guess what? I'm not using the, the gun. I'm using um, um, that buddy. It's my brand new crossbow. And so I'm going to shoot the deer with that. And we all say goodbye, everyone. To say I'm excited would be such an understatement. This is the same general vicinity that Sarah killed her deer in earlier this year. And it's the same spot, generally speaking, the same spot that I killed my deer last year. So very special place. Hopefully, Buck walks in, and I really could care less how big it is. We're just deer hunting, y'all. This is our very first sit here on the ranch together. Aria has wanted a pocket knife for like two years. She just got one. We had a nice buck come in. He stayed on the outskirts. He was super alert. And as I'm trying to get Aria situated, he moved on and we didn't get a shot. That was frustrating. Then we had a doe come in right before dark and Aria really wanted to shoot the doe, but we're not trying to take does off that property. We're trying to build the deer population and does help do that. So we went back to the house, got a good night's sleep and woke up the next morning and it was freezing cold, like literally in the 30s. And in South Florida, our deer aren't built for 30 degree weather. They're built for warm weather. So we had a spike come in, big old cow horn spike. And I gotta admit, I was very tempted to let Aria shoot that deer. And she really wanted to shoot that deer. But I'm trying to teach her patience and I'm trying to teach her about hunting, not just shooting. Hey, how you like that ugly face? It is day five. We've been hunting and hunting and hunting. Day one was our best day. We had that big buck come in. It was epic. But we're getting down to the end. The season's almost over. Bucks are starting to lose their horns. And if a legal buck comes in, 
Aria is gonna trip the trigger, baby. And look who it is, that's Mr. Floyd. Hello. Obviously we hunt up in Illinois with Floyd and uh, he's a huge friend of ours. He came down to spend some time with us and what we're gonna do, we're gonna drive the truck right back to where we're gonna hunt. This is a ranch truck that, you know, we drive around here all the time, the deer are used to it. So instead of walking in, we're just gonna drive right in, which is a really good idea for a lot of you. I think deer would prefer seeing the truck versus seeing you walking in with all your hunting gear. So uh, we're gonna get in here, get set up. The wind is absolutely wrong for our other blinds, so we're going somewhere totally new. We're gonna set up and see what happens this afternoon. Are right, you think we're gonna get one? Mr. Floyd gave me some. Gave you some chocolate? Oh, he gave you a tootsie roll. Gave you a tootsie roll, huh? I remember. Hey, maybe tootsie roll's good luck. Drop a thumbs up if you've been been enjoying this video. Me and Aria have had so much fun hunting together. So many great times in the blind. And uh, win, lose, or draw, these are memories that will last a lifetime. Look at That's all hog rooting. If a hog comes in tonight, we're gonna turn this into a hog hunt. We just had two does come through. Stay very still. Yes! You did just, you him? did a perfect shot, did baby. Did I? You got I'm him. I'm like, I, I, I couldn't get him, but did he fall? You got him, baby. He's right there. He is? Yes! He is? Oh my God, baby. My legs, I'm like, my butt is burning. Oh. It is burning. Oh my God, baby. You just shot your first buck ever. Yes! Give me a hug, baby. My legs are cold. Oh my God. Oh, Come my here legs. and give daddy a hug. Are <gasps> mm. uh, what do you, oh my God, babe. Legs. You come here. You were so patient. Oh my gosh. My legs. Can we go see him? Uh, he, we're gonna have to get Maverick and trail him. He ran a little ways, but you hit Dead. him good. You yeah. hit him good, good. Can we just go try to find a please? Let's just, we gotta wait. Okay, you guys, no matter how bad you wanna go trail a deer, you gotta wait. You gotta, gotta, gotta wait. But baby, that arrow hit him good. Yes. I was like, I can't even see the front shoulder. Oh. I was so mad at that point. You can't really see it, but this is where she was sitting right here. All right, go grab my phone from over there. Oh, again. 
I was more nervous right then than I've ever been to kill a deer myself. I got my six-year-old. This is our fifth hunt. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I'm like literally so shook up right now. Wow. You guys, I am literally, I don't even know what to say. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we got a call. Cut. I've, I've got to compose myself real quick and we'll figure this out in a minute. This year I got to film my dad, my wife, and my oldest daughter on her first deer hunt. It, this has been such a blessing. And then we always get to go up to Illinois and hunt with my buddy Floyd. Love you, brother. Love you. I mean, just a, this is what outdoors, hunting, fishing, this is what this life is about. Now let's go see how Mav does. Come on, Mav. Mav, find that deer, buddy. Find that deer. Find that deer. Yeah. Aria, wait a second now. I know you're excited. Just let Mav work. He's definitely trailing. He is definitely, definitely, definitely trailing. Aria, slow down. He's smelling the deer for sure. That's exactly where the deer went. Where's that deer, Mav? Where's that deer, boy? Where's that deer, boy? Hold on. Where's that deer, Mav? Where's he at? Can you see him? Where's he at? You mean he, not she. Where's that deer, Mav? He's smelling something else. Hold on. Just let him work. Where's that deer, Mav? Did he go this way? 100%. Deer came right through here. Uh, but I lost him when he <laughs> came through here. I don't know. <laughs> Aria, don't go forward. Just just hold the light. I'm gonna go get my glasses. So I can see something. Aria, stay back. Let Daddy work. There's blood here. There's blood right here. Blood. He was following that the whole entire oh. time. He's gargling on something out there. Huh? Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Where's that deer head? You get that deer, Mav! You get that deer, Mav! He's on the deer. Okay, this is a happy moment for me. This will be the first deer he's ever found. Where's that deer, Mav? Where's he at, boy? Where's that deer at, boy? Where's he at, boy? There's your deer, baby. He found the deer. Go get your deer, baby. Go get him! Oh my gosh! Wow! How awesome is that, honey? Levi's coming over then. Levi's definitely coming over. Mav, you did such a good You see he's barking, he found the deer. Uh, yeah, he did. Good job, boy! Good job, boy! Yeah, you did a good job! That's exactly why we got this dog, is to do exactly that. Good job, baby. And Maverick. Way to go. Wow, what an incredible, epic hunt that was. Aria was so patient. We waited for literally over an hour for that deer to come around and give us a shot. She sat there motionless, not moving her legs until they completely went to asleep. And then when the time was right, she waited for the perfect shot. And that deer was literally like seven yards away. I'm blessed, man, I'm blessed and I'm thankful. And I'm thankful for you taking the time to watch this video and just be a part of my channel. So thank you very much. This, I'm gonna end the video right now, but I hope you guys are having a fantastic start to 2023. If you guys have any ideas that you wanna see me do, if you wanna challenge me to do something or you wanna encourage me to do something, leave it in the comments below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe, like the channel, like the video, comment, tell a friend about it, and uh, I will see you on the next time. Take care, God bless, and we are gone.